Hey, what's your problem, mister? Up, Yoto, it's Fudge, Xtra, me Fudge, today we'll review a cheesy movie called the ice cream man. That's right, the ice cream man from 1995, starring Olivia Hussey, Jan Michael Vincent, and Clint Howard as the ice cream man. And uh, <clears throat> Jay, what now? What do you think of this movie? It's <laughs> terrible. <laughs> but Kaifani how bad that That's right, yeah. It's it's a it's it's I would say it's kinda equal to Troll Two in that way and many other films of that ilk. It's it's bad but it's entertainingly bad. Ooh sounds yummy. You know, we should swap recipes a creamsicle for custard pie. <laughs> Faka Pola and Fia Cream Pola Fuck and Toba. That's right, Clint Howard was a child star who was in the TV show Gentle Ben. And uh, he, he was a cute little kid in Gentle Ben and he grew up to be the murderous ice cream man. But he's, he's been in plenty of other stuff. Um, but uh, there isn't much more to the plot of this movie. Uh, aside from it's an evil ice cream man. He, and we learn, spoiler alert, uh, he was turned evil. Uh, or he, he had some sort of episode where he was in a mental hospital and they injected his brain with goo. And that's... Yeah, you know, that's not good medical care. That's not how you treat anybody. You don't shoot someone's head full of goo. It makes them crazy. But those, he needed to get a second opinion. You were quite taken with the uh, the. I, there's a scene where there's an eyeball on the ice cream cone, and you you really uh, that really stoked some reaction out of you. That's the guy that. No, that's the one. a very fake looking eye. That's right, didn't even notice. Here you go, detective. Just for you. Hey, now that's an ice cream cone. Mmm, what's in it? Classified officer. Classified. Ooh, you were a quick one, ice cream man. You're a quick one. I guess if you order an ice cream cone with a bunch of junk on it, you might not notice something like that. Um, but that seemed pretty, pretty glaring, pretty glaring uh, oversight on that gentleman's part. Now, there's another uh, interesting aspect of uh, the ice cream man is that one of the kids in it. Um, is supposed to be he's supposed to be uh, a little overweight and instead of hiring an, an overweight child they just kind of stuck a pillow under this kid's shirt which seems uh cheap and stupid but that's on par with the rest of the movie ice cream in it. what do we think of well, I guess it's I see how it's talking as as me, my sweet 
soft mom. That's right, Amy, your sweet soft mother and my sweet soft wife. Uh, she was asking, "What did you think of the very? End? What did you think, Jamin, at the very end when the kid went?" <laughs> Are you distracted by the Gremlins poster we put up? That's new, right? Yeah, we put a Gremlins poster up right over here. You like Gremlins, though. That's a better movie than Ice Cream Man, right? Yeah. yeah. Do you, so do you think they should make a sequel? Should they make another terrible Ice Cream Man movie, Jason? <laughs> I agree. Jay, man, these are the ingredients you need for ice cream. You need ice, milk, sugar, and eyeballs. You need a, lots of human eyeballs, and maybe some blood, and a guy's head, and some hair. Mine. Would you be the ice cream prince, or would you be the ice cream king if you were an ice cream man? Hmm. <laughs> It's okay, you don't have to come up with an answer now. We're not buying you the ice cream truck until tomorrow. Then you need to tell us what to pay on the side of it. Jason, can you tell me what the moral of the ice cream man is? Never make a school to troll. <laughs> The moral, that's right, Jason. The moral of the ice cream man is never make a sequel to Troll. There's no moral to the ice cream man. I think it's just an interesting story. And uh, a bad movie. And I give it I give it one star. How many stars do you give it, Jay Man? At a one out of four. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Bur burp? Right now, let's say thank you to the makers of the Ice Cream Man for this beautiful 1995 offering. It kept us quite amused. Well, this is J-Man and the Jokester, and we'll see you at the movies. Not literally, figuratively, because it's not safe to go to a movie theater right now. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for time. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs>